Hello YouTube, welcome to today's video. It's going to be another response to David Hewlett, who asked people to talk about something they really care about and, you know, hope that others could be excited about just by, you know, how that person talks about the topic. So today I'm going to talk about something that's slightly controversial, Probably not for my long-time audience, but maybe for some of my new audience. Um, GM crops. Because I do hope to eventually go into biotechnology and maybe in particular agricultural biotechnology. And I do think that GM crops have a great potential. Um, separate from all the legal issues around companies doing certain things with their crops. Um, GM crops are generally proven safe by a lot of research, and I'm going to list a few examples of positive GM crops. First one, Golden Rice. It's a not-for-profit project that is engineering rice to produce beta-carotene, which then turns into vitamin A in the body. So, if this crop was widely used, it would essentially solve vitamin A deficiency in certain parts of the world, which is awesome. The second uh, example is a type of GM wheat being developed in the UK. It produces a compound from mint that repels aphids and attracts aphid-killing wasps. So, essentially, it's engineered to produce a natural compound that would replace pesticides. And still, organic people are against it because it's GM. And another recent example is uh, researchers recently found a gene that um, uh, takes in additional iron from the environment, so it could lead to crops that are um, iron-rich. So that's cool. And there are just a number of... <clears throat> Projects trying to make crops that are disease resistant uh, have higher yields, and really, like a vast majority of the research in this area has really good intentions and really great potential. So, I highly recommend that you uh, Google some of these projects, and uh, yeah. Uh, don't, you know, don't give up on an entire technology because some people are misusing it. Because a lot of people are trying to use it for good. And we should support those people. Um, that's it for today. Thank you for watching.